Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So as you understand in this review, I'm talk, going to talk about MSRIT, all the documents required, hostel fees and the case at Comet K fees. So let's uh, start first with the documents required. So all the students who are joining through KEA or CET admission process in the first semester, they are required to bring the KEA admission order which is KSET admission order or DSET admission order depending on which mode you are coming through KEA. So original plus four copies of admission order, then intranet online application form which is internal form. So you don't need to bother about this. You need to provide this. Once you go there for reporting that time, they will allow you to uh, provide uh, fill the application form and that will be separate so you don't need to bother about the point number two now so now the next is the 12th mark sheets you uh, know and xerox copies 12th class mark sheets and xerox copy tc which is the college living certificate for all the students from karnataka if you are architecture student then you also need to bring your nata scorecard for architecture migration certificate for if students have done their class 12th or puc from outside of karnataka then they need to bring migration certificate study and conduct certificate only for students of karnataka like seven years of rural quota uh, like 10 years for the rural quota and seven years for urban quota certificate if claiming under the special quota category then those certificates cast and income certificates if you are claiming sc st category one category two and category three next you need to bring your two photos passport size xerox copy of aadhar card and blood group report and physically handicapped students also bring their relevant documents so this is applicable only for kea cet process now let's talk about what are the documents which are required by the comedy care students and the management quota same set of documents required right so admission uh, order which is should be the comedy care admission order and four copies of that and the confirmation letter which is required for management quota students so management quota, quota students confirmation letter and four copies comedy care student admission order and four copies then intranet online application form again this you don't need to bother about this they will give you the separate application form once you reach the college so there only you need to fill and submit it next is 12th mark sheets and xerox copies 10th mark sheets and xerox copies rank card of your comed k if you are coming from at comed k and if you are coming through management quota then you should bring your je rank card if you have given right then their TC transfer certificate for all the students who are from Karnataka and have written the comedy K exam at the management quota. Nata scorecard again for the comedy K architecture students. Migration certificate if the students have studied from PUC or class 12 from outside of Karnataka. Those comedy K and the management quota students should bring the migration certificate. Cast and income certificate. This is not applicable for comedy K students as uh, there is no reservation category, but uh, it is mentioned here. Two photos, passport size, Xerox copy of Aadhaar card, and uh, then blood group report. So those are the documents required for comedy K student. This is for 24-25. So this is their official update. And you can see UG courses BE and BR fee structure for 24-25 batch, right? So first you start reading from the top. The first is CET, which is nothing but KSET. So KSET, they have two basically BE and BR. So if you see the BE, there are three type of fees. One is the SNQ quota, which is supernumerary quota. That fees also has increased this year from earlier 44,000, 45,000 to now 51,000. So there is a big fees, right? So even SNQ quota students will have to pay 2 lakh rupees to complete their engineering BE, BTEC. Second, you see Karnataka KAR under CET, you see the fees is 1,27,245, which is a quite big fees uh, which you are getting through government quota seat in a private engineering college. So 1.27, that means your BE will not be less than 5 lakhs total. 
so total what you can expect is minimum 5.2 lakhs right for four year b right even in the c k set quota if you are from non karnataka and came through k set then it will be 1 lakh 28700 that means only 1000 extra br courses if you are student from br you can check it is also like same 1 lakh 28 and 1.3 lakhs now talking about the comed k comed k students don't have snq quota but comed k students have, which are from karnataka the total fees right you would have paid 2.81 lakhs you would you would have paid 2.81 lakhs during the counseling of the round 1 and most of the students will pay 2.181 in round 2 and round 3 but after that 2.81 lakhs additional additional 30000 you have to pay once you are in college so total comed ke fees for be in karnataka students will be 3.12 lakhs so that's why students are getting surprised when they are visiting college they are charged 30000 extra and if you are non karnataka from delhi from north india the total fees for one year will be 314087 so this is for the cet and comed ke and some students are also coming through pradhan mantri scheme which is applicable for jammu kashmir student for government of india students for and others right for them also non karnataka fees is 128745 similar amount you will they will be charged for br so i'll come covered k set and the comed k now you see the bottom table it says nri quota or the management quota so students who are getting from nri quota or management quota they will also have to pay 50000 for csc branch uh, which is miscellaneous fees information science acsc aiml and csc specialization branch also 50000 ec also 50000 and all the branches 50000 as a miscellaneous fee if you are coming from nri quota or the management quota also now talking about the diploma students who are directly getting admission to the secondary year fees right which is later entry for them also if you see d set fees for this year will be 128595 so this is very much similar to what is k set so k set is equal to d set fees 1286590 and somebody is coming from the pradhan mantri scheme for jammu kashmir and you know, government of india etc they will be charged 128000 they'll coming from outside of karnataka now i'm going to talk about the hostel facilities and the fee structure so these are some of the pictures of their overview of the hostel facilities and in terms of facilities provided it provide for single double triple occupancy with attached and common bathrooms so i will share the fees at the end two spacious halls are there for comfortable dining breakfast lunch evening snacks special dinners are all included and it includes both the north indian and the south indian food items and then you know eight eight washing machines are also available on the campus for laundry ironing are provided at subsidized rates led tv newspaper and magazines are available in the hostels and the three hostel blocks indoor and outdoor game facilities are available and then the light refreshments and canteen up to 12 midnight you know and health center is provided in the campus itself available between monday to saturday you know 5 to 7 pm and medicines are also provided at extra at free of cost and ro drinking water guest rooms are also provided and cable and wifi facilities so this is the hostel staff structure with the management officials this is particular one is the freshers block where the first year student go this is particularly the nri nri, NRI block then this is one of the picture of their aribhat hostel block this is pg boys hostel which is at msr nagar right and this is the laundry facilities which i just mentioned and this is the recreation tv room part of ms ramay and technology this is one of the dining hall and this is one of the second dining hall which is part of the hostel facilities so now again some timings are ever mentioned with respect to breakfast lunch snacks and dinner so you can watch them 
now talking about the hostel facilities so fees is like triple sharing double sharing and single sharing for the triple sharing the hostel fees plus mess fees for msr it ms ramesh technology in bangalore will be approximately 1.5 lakh rupees so this will cover all the accommodation in the hostel and all the meals which i have talked about in the previous uh, slides right and if you are going for the double sharing it will be around 1.7 lakhs all put together for one year and for single sharing it will be still higher which is approximately 1.9 to 2 lakhs so that's all details about the hostels documents and the fee structure thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on all colleges in karnataka